These days, we're all pretty used to storage devices coming very large gigabyte capacities. But in this video, we're going to look at a slightly older technology. Thanks for a request from Jeff, who wanted to know how I could mount an internal CDRW or DVDRW in a laptop on FreeBSD. Before we start, if this is your first time to the channel and you would like to learn more about FreeBSD and the journey to a better desktop and server, then please hit subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss out. Right, it wasn't specified whether he wanted to, uh, to show how to write to a DVD, but I'm just going to show a basic mounting of a DVD. In this case, it's a simple video DVD. So, in a terminal, we're just going to go into root. Now you could do this if you've set permissions correctly. Do this as a normal user. So I'm just going to clear that. And the first command we're going to use is mkdir for make a directory. And we're going to make the DVD one so we can mount it. Next, we're going to actually mount the DVD drive, or specifically the DVD in the DVD drive. We've mount hyphen T and the file system. And then we mount it to the DVD directory we just created. There we go. And you can check that it's working correctly if you ls for list the contents of the directory and we should have oh there we go the audio and the video uh, directories of the dvd i put in um, in this case it was a vi simple video dvd and when you finished you unmount it with u mount and if you list it again nothing comes up so we created a directory mounted it listed it and then unmounted it but once you've created the DVD directory, you only need to do that once. Of course, you could put a CD in there. It doesn't have to be a DVD, but it's as long as it's somewhere that you recognize as being the optical media. In the mount command, we used forward slash dev forward slash CD0. Now, if you're unsure as to the actual, I don't know, description or whereabouts of your CD drive, using cam control dev list, it should list all the available drives on your machine. And as you can see, the top one is my main hard drive. Underneath is, I know it's a TSST Corp DVD plus RW. And following on the line, it says it's at ZD0, comma, pass one. So CD0 is what we use. Of course, yours might be CD1 or CD2 or whatever it's labeled. As long as you know what the drive is, you'll know where it is. Now, I don't know whether... Jeff actually wanted him to uh, show how to write a disc. He didn't specify that, but I'll just assume that he just wanted it to be mounted. And this should work really with any data, DVD or CD you put in. I must admit that it's uh, it's not something that I use on an everyday basis. I used to do, of course. I mean, we all used to use some kind of optical media, and now it's just easier just to put in a USB stick. But for those who still use DVDs and CDs, I think this might be useful. Let me know in the comment section down below if I've made a mistake, which I probably have, or you actually find and still use DVDs. Anyway, I hope this was useful. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time. This and every other video on my channel has been made using FreeBSD and open source software.